4. Petitioning heaven for God's will to come to pass. We are told in Luke 2.36 that a woman called Anna who lived in the temple for years served God with fastings night and day. This woman with a prophetic anointing came by when baby Jesus was being dedicated in the temple and the record has it that coming in that instant she gave thanks to the Lord and spoke of him to all those who looked for redemption in Jerusalem. 5. A sacrifice to God that delights him. Paul writes in Romans 12 to 1 I beseech you therefore, brethren, by the mercies of God, that you present your bodies a living sacrifice, holy, acceptable to God, which is your reasonable service. 6. Watching. When Paul the Apostle was on a ship heading to Rome a tempestuous wind called Euroclidon eventually led to a shipwreck on the island of Malta. The story of their deliverance from the very difficult situation and several days of darkness and being lost at sea was divine providence. In the reference verses Paul spent time fasting with prayer petitioning the Lord of heaven for the lives on the ship and he heard from heaven that no lives will be lost. He said there stood by me this night an angel of the God to whom I belong and whom I serve.